Hey guys, Bench85 here. Um, it's been a little while since I've done a little video log here. Um, please excuse the lighting, it's not perfect. Um, I don't have things set up uh, for webcam streaming at the moment. Um, it's been a while since I've actually webcam streamed. But, I want to talk to you guys about streaming in general. Um, as you know, I've been doing a lot of streaming here on YouTube and I think it's time for me to move away from it. I gave it a chance. I wanted to, I, you know, I hoped it would um, it would do decent. Um, it has been pretty good, but it just doesn't have the options that I want. Uh, namely, I want it to be able to um, to really utilize bots. Um, I want it to be able to use an overlay that works really well. Um, I want to be able to have follower and subscriber um, notifications and you know be a lot more interactive um, basically I want to clean it up and make it a lot more professional looking so I'm gonna be moving my streaming away from YouTube I hope you guys can follow uh, me over I'm gonna be back on beam.pro uh, the link is always in my video description so you can always go find it there um, is beam.pro slash bench85 I think that's what it is maybe I don't know I'd have to double check but you guys can double check because it's down in the link down below this video um, in the description yeah right right down there I don't know you guys can figure it out <laughs> the other thing I want to talk to you guys about um, the other reason why I'm doing this um, the re one of the reasons why I brought my streaming over to YouTube is, as you know, um, I do monetize my videos, and I wanted to see if it was worthwhile um, to stream on YouTube, um, if it would generate any sort of income. Um, I hate talking about numbers, I hate talking about money with you guys, but when it comes down to it, as much as I love doing this for you guys, um, it also doesn't hurt the fact that at least at this point I get you know a couple bucks at the end of the month I'd like it more than that um, trust me I would really love it to be more than that uh, because then it would allow me to focus a lot more on streaming and on, and on videos um, right now money's pretty tight for me so I've been not doing as many videos not doing as much streaming and making money where I can um, so you know it's been tight ever since I uh, changed to a different job um, for numerous reasons um, and I enjoy my new job and I just recently got a raise in it and things are looking a little better but at the same time it's still a struggle and I've started up doing my computer business on the side um, trying to generate stupid Windows 10 notifications um, to generate a little extra income while I can um, just doing things on the side you know doing what I can and uh, that's something that YouTube doesn't allow you to do very well with streaming. So by moving over to Beam, um, if I can improve things enough, you know, maybe I can get um, subscriber status so that you guys could subscribe to me and get special benefits and all that kind of stuff. Um, I'm also probably going to be utilizing something called StreamJar, um, which basically provides a really simple, easy link in the stream so that if you guys want to support me if you want to throw in a dollar or something um, just to help me out it would be there um, I'm not telling you guys to do this I'm not forcing you guys to do this this is why I hate talking about this but um, I think it's my best option and beam if you're not familiar with it is like twitch but nowhere near the following but I think much much better uh, the new features that beam has is absolutely amazing um, they're much more in tune with their user base both on the streaming and the watching side uh, so I think they do a really good job um, what else oh of course latency uh, when dealing with streaming on YouTube and Twitch itself it's probably f anywhere from 15 to 25 second latency uh, delay basically so if I die on screen it takes you guys like 20 seconds to actually see me die and then type that I died and oh no things are horrible uh, ha 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 you died but I don't see that response until like 30 seconds later 
and I've already respawned and all that kind of stuff. Um, beam is like five seconds and sometimes less on a good night. So it's almost instantaneous and that makes for really good interaction between viewers and streamers. So I guess basically I'm making this video to inform you guys that that's what's going to happen. Uh, no more YouTube streams. I may record some of my streams if they're special things and release them on YouTube. Um, I should actually double check. It's been a little while since I've been on Beam, but I may be able to pull off the old archives possibly. I know Twitch you're able to do that. I'll have to see if Beam actually allows that. But I hope you guys can support me over there. Like I said, the link for a streaming is in the description right down there as well as my Twitter link um, I will always tweet out when I'm streaming so if you guys want to follow me on Twitter that's your best way of knowing and actually if you s follow me on beam if you go to my page and follow me uh, from that description link link in the description something like that I'm not really sure what I'm saying um, <laughs> it's been a crazy week so I'm a little crazy at the moment um, and it's a little late, but, uh, you can actually follow me. And then if you have, try to think if you have an account on beam, which is free to sign up and it's actually really cool if you sign up because then when you log into my streams, your name shows up, you're not just a guest. You can chat all you want. You can have fun. You can antagonize my bot and you can antagonize me just like you can on YouTube. And actually, if you follow me, then um, you'll get an email every time that I start streaming. I don't remember if there's a way to notify you, like push a notification. Not sure if that's in yet. But uh, yeah, I think join me over there and let's have some fun and let's clean up and kind of professionalize my streaming a little bit. So uh, thank you guys all for your support. Um, I mean, going into this, I'm what? pushing close to 300 subs on YouTube, which is absolutely amazing. You guys are awesome, and uh, I can't thank you guys enough. And I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. And um, any comments, concerns, please send them towards me, whether it be on a comment on a video or even a private message. Um, I read them all, and uh, I usually respond to them as long as they're, you know, actually about something important and not random spam. But uh, I don't usually get spam because you guys are great. So, yeah, I think that's that. So thank you guys all for watching. Thank you for taking your time to watch this in particular. A little bit of a news update. And as always, guys, take it easy.